So an exciting day, brand new piece of equipment to try. Should we see what it is? Let's. Oh, hello. Skyvac. Skyvac. There we it's go. It's a unit. So we're going to be trying this. It's a bit of an upgrade to the machine that I used to have, that we've used before. The Skyvac, for people at Spinner Clean, uh, always telling us how they've got the, the only gutter bag that's specifically designed for that purpose. A number of gutter clearing jobs lined up, so I thought I'd um, take one out for a spin, give it a whirl, we'll let you know uh, how much of a difference you really get. Skyvac's just a little bit too bulky to fit down the side. Uh, it just gets even more narrower just down here. So what you can do is just unclip it from and you can just carry it down any narrow place you need to. Well, from this lower gutter, there's pretty bad with grass growing out of them. Um, in particular, here up the top, see the downpipe? We've got grass growing out of the downpipe. But usually, when you can see something growing, it, the roots are causing a worse problem than, than it looks like from the ground. Uh, the pole at the bottom here has this sleeve. If we turn it just like this, it allows us to release the vacuum. Once we've lifted it out, we'll be able to just drop it to the ground by turning. Uh, and it will be able to just drop to the, the ground where it's safe. So it's a really nice feature. It's much quicker and easier to be able to do that rather than having to bring the poles all the way to the ground. We're just going to move this lever across to heavy, heavy lift. We don't, you don't keep it on that position all the time, but just for something um, like this, uh, and we need that extra bit of oomph, we can just move it to that position and that's going to help us as well. less messing about bringing the poles down um, it's made it much easier not just for getting those clumps of grass out but also sometimes there can be other debris in the gutter twigs or um, fragments of roof tile things like that as long as you check the area below is clear you can just let whatever it is that's clogged up the spout and it will just drop down and you can just carry on working so that's made a big difference I think to to the time it's taken us to get this gutter clear um, and it's made it much easier. So I'm really impressed with that. Uh, for this property this we're actually uh, cleaning this conservatory roof and clearing out the gutters as well at the same time. Wow. Um, the carbon fibre poles are so light, so easy to handle, it means I can reach over something like this conservatory roof to clear out the gutters 
where I normally wouldn't be able to access and look how easily I can reach the poles are so lightweight. say it's much easier than my bulky aluminium poles which are actually uh, quite heavy in comparison to these. Uh, I'll go grab the camera and I'll check that everything is clear, double check we've cleared everything but that's it, that's job done. Look how easily we can tip away the mess. Okay, Craig, let's see what we've collected. Oh, check that out. It's a pretty a good result. It's worm's paradise. All cleaned out with the gutters just here. There we go. Great job. I'm noticing it's a real difference between my machine, uh, my standard industrial vac that I've been using, and this machine here. I'm noticing I'm working a lot quicker. Um, it's sucking up a lot more reliably and um, it's really making a big difference. Cut through that, the mess in there, no trouble at all. So really, it's really been good, I've been really impressed with it. Um, fantastic so far. But...